Hi, this Scratch video tutorial will look at the broadcast message block. So I've just got my um, tips section opened up and let's have a quick read. So broadcast message basically sends a message to all sprites. For example, here you've got a broadcast jump or if you've got a broadcast, sorry, broadcast and there's no specific message there, it sends a message to all the sprites and the background. And this is useful if you want to tell other sprites when to do something. Now, what do you want them to do when they receive the message? And this is when the actual message is received by the other sprite. What is the particular action you want them to do? So let's have a look at this example of a game that I've created where I have actually used a broadcast message. So I'll jump into my um, car and let's see the broadcast message there. So the script that I have for my car is that when the green flag is clicked, move five steps, if on edge bounce, um, set the rotation style left to right so it doesn't um, turn upside down. Repeat these uh, actions until it touches sprite one and sprite one is, um, in my game, the cat. And then, once it's touched the sprite, or once it, the car has hit the, car, uh, the cat, broadcast the message hit. So the broadcast message is where you can jump into your events section, and um, you can um, create a, uh, a new message by clicking onto the drop down arrow, and clicking on new message and typing um, a new message to say jump and okay that. So that's how you can create a broadcast message. In my example here, I've created a broadcast message called hit. So now I'm gonna jump into my cat sprite to see how I can apply when I receive the message hit. So I've got a lot of scripts happening in my cat, but let's have a look at this particular script block here. So the cat is basically saying that when I receive the message hit, we're going to stop all other scripts in the sprite, basically means to end the game. Then I'll play the sound meow until done and say do, I've been hit. So um, let me see if I can <coughs> test that and there you go. So the cat has been hit by the car which means that when the car touches the cat, it sends that message hit and so now the cat has received that message hit, it stops the game, you can hear that it played that sound meow and then it's saying do I've been hit. So that's how you can use the broadcast message block to create games and projects in Scratch.